So hey guys, the lighting sucks, but I did it. I so I'm glad that I've been waiting for this. Now we're just gonna let it dry. I know it's kind of creepy. It's like a person standing. <laughs> Isn't that awesome? I'm really proud of it. Yay, okay. Also, I have another fun piece of news for you guys. Um, I got a new computer today, which is very exciting. I'll have to show it when I actually get it out and set up, but there's, there it is. It is an HP. Um, I heard those are decent, and this one just kind of called out to me, so I'm going with it. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to get it set up, and um, I'll show you guys what it looks like, okay? Well, hi guys! Okay, so I briefly showed you my computer. It wasn't set up or anything. It's been a while now because I've been setting up everything, putting programs on it, but here it is! And CTFX is up right now. This screen is awesome, guys. Look at it. It's a touch screen. I actually, I didn't even notice that. Oh, I, I, I'm still not used to it. I keep forgetting I could do that, but I might like try my best to not touch it as much so it doesn't get a bunch of fingerprints all over it. But no, it's so cool. And like, it actually came with a CD player. Hold on, let me see if I can get it to work. But yeah, no, it even has a CD player on it, which I did not expect because no phone, or no uh, phones, <laughs> of course not phones. <laughs> no computers have those anymore. I hope it'll be okay. Like. I really takes it away, doesn't it? There it goes. It's a little rickety, but you know, like I didn't even expect to get a CD player with this whatsoever. So like, I'm like chill. I'm not complaining whatsoever. Um, but no, it's it's cool. Um, and I'm still gonna be doing editing on this computer, even no matter how broken and. Okay, it's not broken broken, it's just the frame's broken, the internet doesn't connect super well. Um, unless I'm like out in the open, because our, our, um, our server thing or whatever is in the kitchen. Um, it does not reach into my room. But hopefully that will not be the case with this one, because it never used to be the case with my other computer. But then that computer got old, and somehow the frame got like crickety. I hope this frame will be okay. I think it was around like 2012 or or something when I got that computer. I don't even remember. I just know that Haley was still living here, um, who I still refer to as my semi-stepsister, but, and she, I think she was like in one little vlog a long time ago. Um, but no, she was, she was living here when I got my new computer, I think, or they had recently moved out. Regardless, it was a long time ago. <laughs> <laughs> so this thing's this baby's lasted for a long time and that's how I like it I am like one of those people that will keep a computer until it like breaks and to be honest I am very thankful that um, it's really just an internet connection problem and it and the the framework on my computer that's the issue because I really need this computer for editing right now because I of course as always am still behind on it so I I need this computer for editing this Computer does not have an editing software. Computers are later Windows 10 computers or whatever. Um, nowadays, Windows computers do not come with Movie Maker or anything. So, but they do offer like free video things at the Windows Store, and I need to figure out. There's a bunch of options for that, and I have to figure out how to use that, or just buy an actual like editing software. So. This computer's hopefully my old one's gonna do good for me for a while while I'm in transition. And I told my computer, I told it, I'm like, you'll always be very special in my heart. And this is not goodbye. <laughs> it, we're just making friends, and then I even told them, I'm like, you guys are friends now. There's no competition. <laughs> I love you both. <laughs> okay. Anyways, I'm gonna get back to watching some videos. This takes forever when I'm converting files, so I just watch videos until... And now that I have two computers up, I can do all the editing on one computer and then work on videos on the... Or watch videos on the other one, which is... I think is kind of fun. <laughs> just saying. Anyway, um, I just wanted to show you guys that. I'm so excited. And I'm very thankful. This is a great, great birthday gift from my daddy. Okay, so 
I wanted to show you guys this. It's actually kind of sad. <laughs> My dad got rid of our playground. I mentioned a little while back that we were getting rid of it, and I, you know, there was a vlog where I think it's called Childhood Nostalgia or something like that that I talk about what that playground meant to me and everything. And it's so sad to see it's so empty, guys. Like. I mean, I knew it was gone. My dad told me during the whole process that they were taking it down and actually a family bought it, which I, and I hope, I hope they were able to set it up okay and that they have many, many years that they get to enjoy it too. I know it was kind of on its last leg, so hopefully it will be able to be touched up and reused. But yeah, so this is completely empty and it makes me sad inside. Ouch. But, you know, it is what it is. Um, I wasn't using it that much anyways. And I had it here since I was about four years old. So that's about 11 years. My dad built it when I was four. Right, was that one? Yeah, he built it when I was four. He built the deck around the same time. Yeah, he was, he was on a building kick that year so <laughs> yeah so he because I remember when he built this and I also remember that me and my mom and like my brother went off to Idaho while he was building this the deck but yeah so very nostalgic I will miss it but we also might my, my dad's I think was thinking of one we need to fix the fence and two he's probably gonna put another shed or something I just really hope that it's like cool <laughs> My dad has a tendency to make things pretty creatively, um, so let's hope for the best on that one. Cause it'll be nice to have more storage room. That was another thing I was thinking. Though. I'm like, I guess it would be good to have like storage stuff, cause our like the playhouse over there. That's a shed now, basically. <laughs> basically, if I want to hang out in it, I I have to clean it completely out. So, yeah. Anyways. But yeah, so my heart's sad for that, but I'm also just like, you know, I guess it was probably time. Anyway, so I'm gonna get back to watching CTFXC. You guys wanna see my pants again? <laughs> I wanna keep vlogging, apparently. Dad, my dad put them inside. This looks so creepy. Look how creepy that looks. Like, just like the stiff pants because we had to put bags in it. And yes, it sort of fades in different spots, but that's sort of the look I was going for. Because it's, it's very mal-centered. So, I think it looks really cool. I'm excited to wear it, even though they don't, they're kind of tired on me and uncomfortable. But you know what? It's mainly for Halloween. Because we're, Sleek and I want to do a Descendants based thing for Halloween. Mike might be able to go along with it. <laughs> Well, like, he's, not, he's like one of those people who doesn't really know what he wants to be for Halloween. I was like, so if I can find, like, so if any of you guys seen Descendants 2, most amazing movie in the world, um, like, Ben, there's a point when Ben, who is, uh, who is the son of Beauty, or of Beauty and Beast, of Belle and Beast, and he's, like, the next runner-up for King, and he's the one who wanted to bring the kids from the Isle of the Lost in the first movie over, like, for, you know, the, the villain kids over to give him a second chance and, like, all that stuff. And he's, it's super cool. And then the second one, Mao's under a lot of pressure. She kind of ends up going back. That's not a spoiler, by the way. Like, everybody kind of knows it. She goes back to the aisle, and they kind of have to go and rescue her. So Ben has this amazing, beautiful, fantastic, wonderful outfit that he wears because he has to look like, he has to blend in with the aisle of the lost. So... He, like, has, like, this leather jacket like the rest of them and, like, these dark pants that have cool things on it. So, we were thinking, I was like, okay, since you don't know what you want to do for Halloween, that's okay. I have an idea. If you don't want to do it, that is totally fine. But if you're, like, up for it, he likes the movie, too. So, I'm like, and if I find a good blue leather jacket that we can use for Ben for his Isle of the Lost outfit. That's kind of the hardest part of that outfit. The rest could be kind of easy to throw together. So if I could find a good one, would you be like, would you feel up to being Ben if, and then I could be Mel? And so, yeah, he's like, sure, if we can find like, especially if we can find a decent leather jacket. So yeah, those pants are preparing for 
Halloween. We're hoping to actually have a really cool, fun celebration this year, so. Yay, it's good to start early. Okay, now I'm gonna go back to my videos. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>